In this video here, we're going to talk about MLK and Malcolm X, who was the Bella civil rights, civil rights leader. And I'm going to pull these facts straight out of my cornhole because a lot of people don't want to hear the truth. And they got to hear what I got to say, man, because common sense will tell you about these two civil rights leaders and who was the better fit for the black race. But let's get to MLK. MLK, man, he was a black civil rights leader. And uh, he was for the blacks or whatever. But he was more involved into the other race of the white people. And uh, they was kind of promoting Dr. King on the television. You know, giving him speeches and whatnot what not to speak to the black people and things and whatnot. But... Dr. King made a terrible mistake. And that mistake was when he went on that podium and told everybody about this big old dream he had and wanted everybody to come together, the segregation. But what he didn't know and what he failed to realize is the segregation with other races only made things worse than it already was. And the reason I'm saying this is because Dr. King was gave that dream, that speech, and he spoke it. And to this day, that dream only thing made things worse than what it is because whatever was written on that paper and what he spoke was already set in motion for another uh, controlment of the world to control our race of people. And that's exactly what he did. And Dr. King knew this, you know, before his timely death, he even spoke about it. He said, I made a terrible mistake that I wanted everybody to come together, little white kids and black kids to raise hands, hold hands, sing along. And this was a terrible mistake I made. And to this day, people get buried in black graveyards the white people get buried in their white graveyard you go to school where are the white kids and the black kids sitting they are separated and i'm not trying to say this a bad thing but i feel like segregating with them type of people only made things worse but just like you go to church so if you go to a white people church, you get better treatment than anybody in there. And I'd be like, is it because of my skin color or because I'm black? And then everybody give me special treatment. Like, how you doing, sir? Oh my God, come back, you know. And Martin Luther King made a mistake, man. When he got up there on that podium, and told everybody to come together. And it was, you know, back in that time, it was way worse. Way worse. But let's get to Malcolm X. See, Malcolm X is a civil rights leader too. And you know, Malcolm X wasn't for the segregation. He said only it'll make only things worse than what it is. And that was true. And Malcolm X wasn't no sellout. Malcolm X got popped by his own people bro and that's still happening to this day i tell you man you speak the truth you get popped if you don't want something you get popped and when you when you when you know the truth that's when they send them goons at you i mean michael max was up in the he was on the podium giving a speech man his own people came in there and lit him up For real. Y'all ever see that, that photo of uh, Malcolm X standing by that door with that Nina tray? He wasn't for the segregation. He wasn't for trying to get along with some people that didn't like him. Like, how can you get along with somebody that don't like you? And everybody ain't like that. You feel me? But back in them days, it was terrible, bro. 
for color folk. And Malcolm X is a real true leader to me. And I have to pick Malcolm X over Dr. King. And that's why you see they always promoting Dr. King's birthday. And uh, they gave him the speech, man. What about Malcolm X, bro? Like, he don't have a holiday like that. Like a big holiday like MLK. It was all a plan, bro. It was all a set up from the beginning, man. And when Martin Luther King found out about it, he got popped, man. And then after he got popped, he wasn't he went even declared dead. He was still alive and he went to the hospital. And we already know what happened after that. So Malcolm X is the better civil rights leader to me. And that's my opinion and it's common sense. Don't get me wrong, MLK took some bruises. He took some uh he took a lot of backlash and stuff, but he was working with the people. Like how many people like him had like airtime on television? Like he was given more opportunities to promote what they wanted. It only did the only thing it did was made everything worse than what it is. The whole plan was to turn their brothers against brothers and sisters. That's why you see so many people, black people, selling their soul and people getting popped in the street with Nina Trades, man. For real, it's all ultimate failure, bro, to keep the blacks poor. That's all their dream was about. A terrible nightmare. What it was. Dr. King didn't have this dream, man. This facts. They gave him the dream to speak. Wrote it on paper and told him what to tell the people. For real. And when you hear the other race saying, oh, we didn't want, we didn't, we didn't want this. Nah, y'all did want this. Y'all wanted this segregation. And you got it. It was the worst mistake ever. What y'all think about it? Do y'all think MLK was the better civil rights leader or Malcolm X? I think Malcolm X was. Let me know in the comment box. It's the robot. I'm out.